Hi, I'm Maureen Kern, Image and Wardrobe Consultant, and I'm at the beautiful Morning Glory Boutique in Burlingame, California. Today we are talking about how to hang jeans. Here are a pair of jeans, and this is the way they hang them in the store. I have three different options for hanging jeans. In my favorite way of hanging jeans, I unbutton the top button and I hang them as if there were a crease, even though there isn't, and I would never put a crease in jeans in an ironing. However, I do it this way at the top. I look at the bottom, I line up the inseams, and I fold them as if there were a crease. So here we go. I smooth it down. I put them on a hanger like this, and in the closet they stay nice and fresh and don't wrinkle. A second way I like to hang jeans, which is the way most people hang jeans, is I keep the pants the way they are, the legs the way they are without any type of crease. I just fold them in half. Normally I fold the rear side out this side in, put them right over a hanger, just like this. The third way I like to fold jeans is especially when I've washed them and I want them to drip dry. This keeps them looking fresh and nice, no ironing, no wrinkles. I first fold them as if they were a men's slack. I would never put a crease in an iron. However, I will match up the inseams. And then what I do is I put them out on a flat surface, smooth it, and then I hang them upside down on this type of a hanger, a skirt hanger or a pant hanger like this. I smooth it down, and this part stays nice and smooth while it's drawing. This part may not stay as smooth, but once you put it on, you smooth it out. So this is my favorite way to hang jeans when they're wet and drying. There you have it. This is how I hang jeans. <laughs>